hi guys good day to you all how is everyone doing hope you all are well so on today's vlog i'm going to be showing you how we make the nigerian fufu the authentic way of making nigerian fufu and at this point i'm already at the compound so that's what we are going to be doing today so before we get right into the video don't forget to like comment and share and most importantly don't forget to subscribe to my channel so let's get right into the video so guys it's currently three minutes past 7 a.m and i'm here now so we are going to be starting very very soon yeah so this is the woman's daughter bringing out the fufu from inside the house so guys this is cassava dough and She's trying to measure out the portion we are going to be cooking today. So, some people mold it with hands directly into the boiling water. Why some tie it this way you are seeing it right now before adding it into the boiling water? So at this point, we are done tying up our fufu. So the next step is putting it inside the boiling water because we have a big pot of boiling water of fire already. Mommy, she wants to put inside the water now. So now our fufu is on fire and we are going to allow it to cook for like 35 to 40 minutes then bring it out, pound it, then mold it in back again. So right now our fufu is like 40% ready so we are going to bring it down so we can pound it before molding it back into the fire again. So at this point she's done pounding this particular one so now she's going to take it off the mortar and then pound the rest as well. So after pounding it, it's time to mold it back into the boiling water this time around we are not going to tie it anymore with the nylon but rather we are going to wrap it this way mold it this way i mean to say then put it back into the boiling water So 
so now we are done molding our fufu it's time to take it back into the boiling water So now we have added everything inside the pot. We are going to cover it to allow it to cook for like one hour or one hour plus before bringing it out to pound it. That way our fufu is ready. So a few hours later our fufu is ready and it's out of the fire so it's time for us to pound it. and our fufu is ready so it's now time for us to bring it out of the mortar as you can see so she's putting it inside the cooler now to keep it warm so it's time for us to wrap it up with this nylon you are seeing we are going to be wrapping it um bit by bit and it's sold for 100 naira per one according to them This one like this, 100 naira. Yes. Since I'm putting money now, it's of course now. Yeah. So we are done and it's time for me to go home and guess what they gave me lots of fufu to take along with me so i'll see you guys when i get home yes so guys i'm back home and guess what they gave me lots and lots and lots of fufu hey let me show you guys see see all the food they gave me six let me keep it this way you see it too. they gave me six wraps of fufu to enjoy myself i can't finish this so for the record <laughs> i can only eat two out of this and uh, maybe next time we'll eat the rest. This food now can last for like three to four days without getting spoiled. All you need to do is just warm it and you are good to go. So I want to eat now. Let me see how it's going to be like. So now, guys, let's eat. Yeah. Okay. And I'm having it with our native soup. This is a native soup. It's called white egusi. This soup is, is uh, melon seed soup. It's pepper soup egusi. You know I'm from Delta State, so this is my native soup. So I'm having it with this. So let's go. Mm. The texture is nice. I like it. Very nice. Mm. 
and this is momo cow skin nice nice when i like it i love it so guys i hope you enjoyed watching that vlog um the meal was nice and yummy and the texture of the food was very nice as well so on that note that brings us to the end of this vlog and um before you go please don't forget to like comment and share with your family and friends and most importantly please don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching if i return a subscriber thank you if i need subscriber welcome to the family thank you so much and god bless you so until next time on our next vlog see you guys and bye bye guys <laughs>